Suki Waterhouse had no idea how drastically her life would alter between the time she started writing Memoir of a Sparkle Muffin and when it was published. A month away from the release of her sophomore album, she acknowledges during a call from London that there have been a lot of new things happening at once. At the beginning of the year, she became a first time mother, which is the biggest shift of all and the next hyphen to add to her ever growing list of titles, while the majority of her first album was Waterhouse viewing her life through a bird's eye view. Examining and dissecting the poisonous relationships she had up until then, she is now discovering that motherhood, love, and comfort can be just as empowering. With the release of her debut album, I Can't Let Go, Waterhouse appeared to disprove critics who had long dismissed her as nothing more than the model hyphenate and failed to recognize her as a legitimate musician. In case her first release demonstrated her dedication to her art, Memoir of a Sparkle Muffin delves into her personal transformation. She still listens to the same music every day, though. I have a song by Arthur Godfrey called It's All Part of the Story by the Magnetic Fields that has everything on it. I'm a big fan of Macy Gray's music. I essentially listen to Karen O all the time.